Garoppolo. And this one brought in by a man who missed all of last year, Calvin Benjamin. And they do finally get him, but he takes it to the 25. A big play there on the catch and run. 61 yards. They'll come out in the pistol. Now a first down carry, it's Williams. And he stopped immediately there. No gain on the play there, second down. So nothing there. I don't know that that's all in the back, though. you got to look at blocking there, don't you? I would agree with that totally. At some point, they have to win at the point of attack. Instead, it was the defense getting it done again and holding them to no gain. And the two-minute warning lurking. This will probably be the last play before we hit it. Yeah, they want to get themselves in position to score in this last shot before the clock hits. And time for us to take a break here in the booth. Back to Tennessee after this. Garoppolo now. Oh, the ball comes out on the hit, but they'll say it's incomplete. It's a tried and true formula, and I don't think it'll change for as long as we play football. If someone's trying to throw the ball and you can put pressure on them and make it tough, that's only going to help your defense. Yeah, he's since being hurried. He got rid of it before taking the hit, but incomplete. So here we go now. An extra defensive back in there on third and ten. He'll drop to throw. A hit as he throws there, incomplete. Third down is a down. Both sides know they absolutely have to win. And the name of the game for the defense is pressure on the quarterback. But pressure on the quarterback with contact, that's how you end up winning it. And Tucker's kick right there. It's good. And that will make this a nine-point lead. So a good kick that time, and he's able to redeem himself from the previous miss. And fortunately for him, he got the chance to do that not long after missing the first time. Sometimes a whole game goes by, and you don't get that chance at all. So you keep it with you till the next time you take the field. And he'll get it up to about the 26-yard line just across the 25. And out now comes Jacksonville as they get ready to go. And on that last drive, went for it on fourth, turned it over. A good job by their defense, though. They held them to three, but this offense, they've got to be a little bit better, a little bit more careful here. And sometimes when you see these calls on fourth down, when they decide to go for it, it's not necessarily the coach saying, I believe in my offense. Sometimes the coach saying, I believe in my defense. I can afford to go for it here, because if we don't get it, I don't think we'll give up more than three. And that's exactly what happened there. you think that factored in? I do. I think that he had that in his mind going into the game, that I'm going to be aggressive on offense because I know I've got a defense that can hold up their end. He's got to be kicking himself right there.